So next what I'm going to do is I'm going to weld these bosses on in the middle, like so, somehow. We're, uh, we can't be far off. Well, that's uh, that'll do for what we're what we're making. I'm just going to use these bolts temporarily. Um, I'm going to need to get some. These are 45s, I think. These are these are closest I've got in stock, so I need to get some 40s. Uh, they'll do for now. Do for getting it together, and then I'll get some bolts and swap them over. Right, so there we go. That's that installed. Obviously, it'll sit more like that once we get all the bottom linkage in. We're going to carry on with the brakes with the piece that sits at the bottom of the brake hangers, which keeps them separated the right distance apart and also attaches to all the linkages that goes back to the lay shaft. I've cut some pieces of 30mm by 6mm. These two are for the pieces at the bottom of the brake hangers, and this piece is the equaliser bar that sits at the back which connects to the lay shaft. I'll tack those two together. Uh, I need to just take them down to size and I need to put a slot in.
done. Next bit. So we've just made those. Temple bar, 46 long, 315 mil. Now these are for these pieces that is only mill, which I've cleaned up, made them very nice. And I'm going to put these in there like so. I'm just putting normal nuts on for now. It's gonna come back apart anyway. So we'll save the nylocks till later.
Right, so you've just seen me install these rods, uh, which are the brake linkages, which link everything up. Um, this here is the equalising bar, which we next have to connect from here to this lay shaft over here. A boss with an arm coming down with then a linkage that goes between the two. So as this rotates, it pulls this and puts the brakes on. And obviously because it's pulling in the middle, it doesn't matter if one of them slightly out, it'll equalise itself out. So that's it for this episode. Join me in the next one. Stay safe. Ladies. Nice.